So I'm on the way to Walmart, the second Walmart, because the first one didn't have what I needed. Um, but apparently there's a tornado watch and um, schools are closed today. I found all this out yesterday. So I'm just trying to get what I need to get back in the house now because I have been in the house uh, today. Because I've been in the house for a few days now. I'm a little eager to get out the house, so I have my mask. I feel like I could go back to work tomorrow. And hopefully I do, because I can't take no more of this. Starting to brighten up a little bit over here, but. So I'm gonna grab what I need and get back in the house, but, oh, and probably an acai bowl, because I'm trying to eat the right kind of thing. So, I'm probably gonna go get that from uh, Tropical Smoothie, Tropical, I think that's what you call it. So yes, it is in fact called Tropical Smoothie Cafe. Here you see their menu, um, just so you can get an idea of the kind of items that they sell. But I was originally introduced to Tropical Smoothie Cafe just because of the smoothies. I love a good smoothie. They have green smoothies, and then they have like your fruity type smoothies. And then even on top of that, they have food, which was always a plus for me because the food's pretty good. Um, and it's on the healthier side. Now... Here's the acai bowl, and yes, again, I said acai, get it right, not acai. Um, but with this bowl, you do have like your acai base to the bottom, um, which tends to be a little more on the frozen side, and I guess they just go ahead and add the fruit, fresh fruit on top. This particular bowl has bananas, strawberries, blueberries, coconut shavings, granola, and of course your chia seeds. They tend to go for about $10 a pop, at this point, because I buy them so frequently, I'm just going to start making them at home. So as you can see, this bowl pretty much fits in the palm of my hand. It actually is a lot within the bowl. It may not look like it. So on average, I can pretty much eat this particular bowl in one sitting unless I'm drinking water along with it. So it is pretty filling. You can eat it for breakfast, lunch, or even a light snack. But I think going forward, I'm going to try to incorporate some pineapples or kiwis along with the honey drizzle. But yeah, here are some other bowls that they're currently offering. Unfortunately, I've only tried the acai bowl. I'm pretty much in love with it at this point. But yeah, be sure to let me know in the comments how you make your acai bowls and what kinds of fruits that you like in yours.